Hi there, Terry Ward again, day six of my 30-day video challenge. Yesterday I got an email from my father-in-law that had bloopers from church bulletins in it, and as I read through them laughing, I thought to myself, it's amazing how changing just one letter in one word can totally change the communication. So I picked a few of my favorites to share with you. Mrs. Johnson will be entering the hospital this week for testes. The senior choir invites any member of the congregation who enjoys sinning to join the choir. There will be a potluck supper on Sunday with prayer and medication to follow. And then I got to thinking how just one nutrient can affect our cellular communication. Well, I know that sounds kind of geeky, but, but hear me out. Without sufficient zinc, our bodies can't properly detoxify, and they may instead produce cancer-promoting chemicals. Without healthy fats, our bodies can't utilize the vitamins A, D, E, and K, nor can they produce hormones. Without sufficient stomach acid, our bodies can't absorb vitamin B12, and a B12 deficiency can lead to memory loss, uh, depression and impaired ability to fight off bacterial infections and possibly irreversible neurological damage if it's not caught quickly enough. It would be great if we could get all of our nutrients from our food because that's the best source, but unfortunately that just isn't reality now. I've yet to analyze a food journal that had sufficient amounts of every nutrient our soils are depleted and our foods are modified such that we would have to eat far too many calories in order to get the right amount of every single nutrient. This chart shows Americans intake percentage below recommended daily allowances for the listed nu nutrients. It's not saying that we're meeting 73% of our need for zinc. It's saying our intake is 73% below the RDA. And it's important to note that RDAs were established to eliminate severe deficiencies like scurvy from vitamin C deficiency and rickets from vitamin D deficiency. The RDAs have nothing to do with optimal amounts or with the degenerative chronic diseases that are so common in America now. I know this can be rather confusing, but that's how I can help. I love helping people determine their nutritional deficiencies and correcting them. So if you're interested in finding out what your nutritional deficiencies are for optimal health, you can contact me through my website at www.terryward.com. That's T-E-R-R-I-W-A-R-D.com.